1998. According to the Eastern Caribbean Central Bank, Antigua and Barbuda tourism sector was the largest of all sectors in the OECS. So that's the speaking in 2018 at the budget debate as senior minister and advisor to the prime minister on ministerial matters. He spoke confidently on the resilience of tourism, stating the industry recovered and boomed after the September 11th terrorist attacks in 2001. Not only is it among the largest industry worldwide, it has demonstrated a greater stability than world trade. It is, Mr. Speaker, an industry in which we can place confidence if properly managed. So Lester said he supported tourism as a force in helping Antigua and Barbuda become an economic powerhouse. However, he cautioned against the negative social and environmental impact that mass tourism could bring. We are better off with 450,000 tourists that generate expenditure of 3 billion than 500,000 tourists that generates the same amount of foreign exchange. He recommended that the industry be dominated by four- and five-star resorts. Celeste also said the country's tourism product at the time needed to be revamped. Our product has stagnated and suffers from inertia. He praised Prime Minister Gaston Brown for recognizing the need to reimagine the industry. In 2019, he approved of the government's decision to sign a deal with Global Post Holding to revamp Heritage Key. The key was Celeste's brainchild. I must again congratulate the Labour Party and the Prime Minister for advancing and further developing Heritage Key. The beneficiaries of that going to be the people of Antigua and Barbuda. He said maintaining Heritage Key would be a part of preserving his legacy. We can't allow it down because all that I did would be lost and I want to see it proceed. So I, I think it is excellent. Celeste died on Monday at 83. He was a national hero, former prime minister and a tourism minister. Jessica Russell, ABS News.